Now it's time to work on strengthening the shoulders. So you don't need any props for this. I will give you a suggestion for an added uh, resist with an added resistance band. So if you want to grab that, have it nearby. If not, I actually love this exercise without any resistance. You can really feel the work. So this is called the teacups. Again, you're going to come to standing, have your feet a nice comfortable hip width apart distance here, toes aiming comfortably forward. Ideally, your second toe and your knees are pointing straight forward, but structurally that's different for lots of people. So just find a nice comfortable stance here. You wanna feel a lift energetically up from pubic bone to navel. So you're feeling some tone through those deep abdominals. Now, you've got two newspapers. Remember those things? Hug them under your armpits and then hug the elbows together with the palms up. I'm at a 90 degree angle here at the elbow. And I'm imagining that I have two teacups, one in each hand. I'm going to try not to spill them yet. Okay. So what I want you to do is bring your teacups together in front of you. Take a nice inhale. And then on the exhale, I'm going to turn my hands out to the sides. And then I'm going to see if I can spill my tea back behind me. And then I'm going to inhale as I come forward. Now, don't drop your newspaper. So as you open the hands to the side, I'm trying to spill the tea back behind me and then hug my newspapers in by my sides. I have one side where I like to drop my newspaper. So I exhale open, inhale to close. Exhale open, spill that tea. Inhale to close. Try that one more, exhale open. Hug those newspapers, spill the tea behind you, and then inhale to close. So you should feel some muscles in the back of the body starting to wake up. This would be kind of around the bra line, the mid to lower back, kind of in, in like mid back region, not up into the upper shoulders. You want to make sure that the shoulders don't hike up to the ears. Keep them away from your ears as you open out to the sides, okay? So that's, pretty, that's a pretty good one in itself. You can add a little resistance here if you take... Um, a TheraBand, longer one is nice, and you can stand on the TheraBand under your feet. Then you've got your teacups in your hands, and you do the same action. So I inhale here, and then I exhale open, and then try to spill that tea with that bit of resistance. The band is nice because it's pulling, as it pulls downward, it helps pull my shoulder blades down away from my ears. And then the resistance also helps that, that, fe that feel of spilling the tea back behind me, okay? I would do about 10 of those. Uh, things to look for as you spill your tea, keep your ribs stacked right over your hips as you do that. So it's real easy to flare the ribs and then you can really spill your tea back behind you. But then all we're doing is, you know, tensing the low back, maybe the neck too, as we do that. So think about those ribs right over the hip bones. It'll feel your core working as you do that as well. So not only is it a strengthening exercise for your rotator cuff, for the muscles that connect from the rotator cuff down into the back, but it's a little bit of a core exercise too. Okay, so there's your strengthening your shoulders teacups exercise.